It was a massive blaze that sparked overnight. Come on, Bubba. Inside the burning building, Orange County Sheriff's Office body camera footage shows the frantic effort to get animals out while they could. To anybody that works in animal welfare, this scene right here is just your living nightmare. Steve Barty is executive director of the Pet Alliance of Greater Orlando. This 30-year-old facility that housed 25 dogs and 41 cats went up in flames around 10.30 last night. Workers from the nearby Orange County Animal Services building ran over and started rescuing animals. It was huge. They did a great job. Uh, you know, I'm glad everybody was safe. Uh, but yeah, they, they noticed the fire, they called 911. When Orange County fire rescue crews arrived on scene, they say at first it appeared the fire started in the front of the building, but it quickly spread, grew hot, and the flames roared. Our first priority was making sure that there were no uh, employees inside, no human life. They were able to rescue all 25 dogs. The dogs were in the back of the building, farthest from where it appears the fire started. 24 cats made it out alive too, but 17 of them didn't survive. Those who work here and love the animals told us they're thankful so many were rescued, but it's still hard to think about the ones they lost. It's very difficult um, emotionally. Um, you know, a building's a building. Um, you know, it, it's, it's the care that we put into each and every animal that comes in here. It was a raging fire that sparked late Wednesday night. Come on, Bubba. An Orange County Sheriff's Office body camera footage shows the effort to save animals trapped inside. You come in here, this is a once in a lifetime fire, quote unquote. I mean, it breaks our heart just being able, driving up to the scene and knowing what it is. Firefighter Brett Maneri with Orange County Fire Rescue later learned 17 cats did not make it out alive. This building, the Pet Alliance of Greater Orlando, housed 25 dogs and 41 cats. Workers from nearby Orange County Animal Services jumped in. Orange County deputies and firefighters did too. They managed to save all of the dogs. They were in the back, farther from where it's believed the fire started. Many of the cats were rescued too. Our whole goal was to at least just search every corner just to find at least at least one animal survivor. While inside this morning, they found two cats that made it through the night. One of his fellow firefighters spotted a third cat hiding in the corner, petrified. She was a lover. She, I can tell she was just so scared and timid and uh, kind of just fell in love with her. She was beautiful. Well, folks here are devastated by the loss. Hi, there she is. Brett Maneri told us the impression one cat named Mia made on him was enough to have him return to adopt her right after his shift ended. They told me that Mia actually was brought up here into Sanford and I came straight here and now she's coming home with me.